man charged for Philadelphia vandalism spree that left two churches and other businesses damaged. After this. What is up, everyone? Philly True Crimes, back at you. And y'all, look at this. Man charged for Philadelphia vandalism spree that left two churches, other businesses damaged. A suspect was charged on Saturday following a series of vandalism incidents across Philadelphia, according to police. Authorities say the man identified as 39-year-old Henny Cooper was spotted around 8.30 p.m. Thursday at SEPTA's Frankfurt Transportation Center and was taken in for questioning. Cooper has been charged in connection with six incidents of vandalism, including two churches and other businesses. St. John Newman Shrine in Philadelphia's Northern Liberties was one among the properties hit, police say. On February 20th, three stained glass windows were broken by rocks and a brick. The church estimates the damage to uh, to the stained glass imported from Austria is worth around $20,000. The area that was broken is going to take extensive work to try to repair it, said Father Mechdel Cunningham, the pastor at the St. John Newman Shrine, the shrine dedicated to the first male saint in the United States whose body is kept on the altar, has been visited by the likes of Pope Francis. Lee says Cooper also targeted another historic church, Mother Bethel AME, on the 400th block of South 6th Street in Society Hill. Police say the church stained glass windows were shattered. The windows date back to the 1800s and will cost around 15 thousand dollars to repair according to the church he is also accused of hitting the science history institute in old city touring apartments on spruce street electronics repair shop on walnut street and the play of bowls in center city oh my goodness see the mess with the play of bowls another video captured by 1600 spruce street Interior design and home shows the suspect causing damage to another small business at 16th and Spruce Street. Police previously stated that Cooper has a history of vandalism and has previously been charged with criminal mischief. This he has been in and out of jail since 2011 for similar crimes. Cooper has been charged with six counts each of criminal mischief and possession of an instrument of crime in the sixth incident. He also has been charged with institutional vandalism for the two incidents involving places of worship, police say. Investigators are still working to determine if Cooper is tied to any other instances of vandalism. Anyone with information is asked to call the police at 215-686 tips if you know anything else that he might be connected to this guy has just been running a rampage running ragged just just run around knocking stuff over and vandalizing property let's look at the video for a minute a man arrested for a string of vandalism cases. those are good enough additional charges tonight the philadelphia district attorney has now charged 39 year old hanif cooper with six cases police say they're investigating a total of 10 similar incidents from February 19th and 20th. Among the cases connected to Cooper are two historic churches, Mother Bethel AME and the National Shrine of St. John. There was a fundraiser today to help pay for the extensive repairs needed at Mother Bethel. Action is That right there is a scene that someone has that type of anger built up in him that they want to just destroy property like this. Well, Hopefully, if there's anything that, that they're missing as far as what he's done, it'll come to light and they'll go ahead and give, give him the punishment that he might deserve or 
the help that he might need. So remember everyone, as crazy as this world can be out there, keep your light shining bright. Stay safe and do the right thing. And please like and subscribe for the latest Philly crime news. We out.